Windex is not just for cleaning windows. The familiar blue window cleaner that we all grew up using can do lots more than just clean windows. It can be used in the kitchen, laundry room, and as a pest control solution. Windex can get rid of small insects such as ants, bugs, spiders, and mosquitoes. So, if you're all for everyday household items that can double up as a pest repellent, Windex is a perfect choice. It'll help you save time and money, not to mention you'll use a slightly less toxic product to achieve about the same results. Windex gets its bug-killing properties from a variety of different toxic chemicals. Here are the main ingredients in Windex. Ammonium hydroxide, also known as ammonia, emits toxic, sulfuric fumes that repel pests. When sprayed directly on the pests, ammonia breaks down the bug's fat and tissues and suffuses its breathing holes with toxic fumes. It also has a drying effect on insects causing them to die. 2-hexoxyethanol is a surfactant, which is a soapy, slippery ingredient that loosens grime from surfaces. This chemical is found in most cleaning products, and its strong fumes can irritate the lungs, skin, and eyes, and possibly deter insects. Sodium dodecylbenzene, like 2-hexoxyethanol, dissolves dirt and grime, and if applied to pests, it dissolves their hard shell and ruins their breathing holes. Isopropanolamine is a chemical that dissolves oils and soap residue on contact. When anything, including a bug, comes in contact with this chemical, it causes a burning sensation that can paralyze the bug. Finally Windex lists a few essential oils in its ingredients known to disgust most pests. These include orange peel oil and cinnamon oil. So here is the best way to use Windex as a pest eradicator. 1. Ants While this will not affect the queen, it is a very quick way to eliminate thousands of ants at a time. Windex, the glass cleaner, is a known insect killer. When you have an ant swarm in your house, spray them all with Windex and they will die nearly instantly. Windex can also eliminate some of the scent trails that ants follow to find food. Ants can still come back if they find more food to eat, but at the very least you can quickly eliminate hundreds at a time with a generally safe spray. 2. Fruit flies. Windex works efficiently against fruit flies and gets them out of your home or workspace. However, it will only kill a portion of the fly population and can't eradicate them entirely. When the flies get sprayed with Windex, they can't fly with the soapy film on their wings, so they crash land, then you can squash them. Sometimes it takes a few shots to down them. If you give them enough time, they will dry their wings off and fly away again. Fruit flies are also not attracted to Windex and won't land again if you spray them with it. However, make sure that you don't spray Windex directly on your fruits and vegetables. 3. Spiders Windex does kill spiders, but only if it's applied directly onto the spider and in a generous amount. When applying Windex to kill spiders you'll need to fully coat the spider in Windex. If applied correctly and you've coated the entire spider with Windex, it will take between 1 minute and 15 minutes to fully kill the spider. You'll begin to see the spider slow down, and eventually their body will begin to curl as the Windex is working through their body, killing them completely. 4. Wasps Windex is very effective for killing most types of bugs inside of the home. However, it's a bit less effective on wasps for some reason, but many will die and those that do not will be slowed enough that you can easily trap them or squash them. 5. Cockroaches Windex can kill cockroaches, but only if you twist the nozzle to stream mode and spray it directly, full strength on a single insect for at least a minute. Windex doesn't have enough insecticide properties to physically kill the roaches via its chemicals. Instead what happens is that when a cockroach, if properly covered in Windex, covers their back, which they breathe out of and it ends up suffocating them. This happens because Windex is so viscous compared to water, it blocks their ability to breathe. 6. Dust mites Dust mites can only be killed with Windex disinfectant multi-surface cleaners on non-porous surfaces. The term porous refers to a material that allows air to pass through it quickly. Therefore surfaces such as ceramic tiles and solid floors which have non-porous surfaces 
are suitable places where Windex would kill dust mites. 7. Gnats. A great way to get rid of gnats on your houseplants is to mix 1 litre of water with 1 squirt of Windex. Water your plants by making sure the entire soil surface is wet. It's not necessary to saturate the soil. Give them a few quick sprays of this watery Windex solution and watch them suffer. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to Natural Health Remedies and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on how to get rid of pests using Dawn dish soap. Thanks for watching and bye for now.